because we haven't uh, seen all that is to see in this area. Just kind of pass through it pretty quickly. Also, you can go down. Does the water drown me? It does. Okay. <laughs> and the zoom in pet there. You know, this music is giving me kind of like a Rayman 2 vibes. I like it. Man, <laughs> I guess you just gotta run towards those guys, right? For cliffhanger. Well, now I can go collect money again, because I spent most of it. Now we got the first strike. I bet you can only first strike with uh, the ladle. Mm, Inferno's not worth it if there's only one guy. So we'll go for Shish Kebab. A salamander. Ah, there's more places below. It's like a cool place to hang out if it was real. Nice little canyon. This stuff. The goddess gave the chief sunstone and taught him to use magic. Or taught him to use his magic. Delighted, the people renamed themselves the Ember. Stopping the endless search, they built themselves a new home, singing praises to the goddess and her mercy. As the years passed, the bright and shining embers built a new civilization, a place of marvels and wonders. They created machines to bring light and warmth to every citizen, that no one should ever have to spend a night in the cold or the dark ever again. Oh. Oops. <laughs> I tried hitting the, uh, Slime ball or mucus ball. Now we can use Inferno. Too bad Loaf doesn't have any multi hit attacks. Um. I would like to use Meteoric Knife, but I think it's kind of overkill. Maybe I should get a Psychic move for, uh, or a Mind move for Yagi. Because there seems to be lots of enemies weak to Psychic attack. It's good to have that uh, type distribution. We're going for this. I want to get that level up as soon as possible. Just gotta check something. I'll be right back. So... Oh, I see. It just connects that way. Didn't realize that. Oh, and that just takes me back to the, uh, the mines. Now I've got a better lay of the land here. Can he attack me up there? Oh dang it. And these these projectile enemies are really strong. They don't have like cooldowns at all. Oh you know what? I forgot to change my types. Oh now Yagi's doing some real good damage now. I appreciate that. Okay, 
And now he needs to remember to uh, change his second move to a psychic. Uh, astral projection. It's so bad though. <laughs> but whatever. I need to get that type distribution. Many years before his long song, the first monk came to know great evil, sleeping under the earth west of his mouth. Fearing the evil might one day wake up and come for him and his disciples, he raised his hands to the sky. With a mighty clap, the first monk split the mountainside in two, creating a deep, bottom, boundless chasm. Safe far from the reach of untold malice, peace flourished on his mountain, and it became a beacon to all who would choose a better way. Hmm. I wonder if that's like where they live now. Ooh, what is this? Grants all buddies an additional 10 plus health. That's pretty cool. They hear a lizard though, or a salamander. I don't know why I keep saying, confusing the two. And that, that, that carries me up for a long time. A strange telescope, an annoyed telescope designed to look like a corn dragon. It's very high tech with lots of adjustable settings. Oh. Well, guys, check this thing out. Wow, oh, they really should have just had them all out. <laughs> just don't swap between. It's so bad. Wow, it's beautiful. Look at that engraving. What is it? It must be some kind of stick for wask wacky nasty critters with it. Let's take it. Um, guys, I don't think that's a weapon. It's a p p pretty sure it's a telescope. Oh. Okay. Can we still keep it? So someone might be looking for it, and it's strangely familiar. Do you think it belongs to? Do you think you know who it belongs to, Dub? I can't, can't remember, but I definitely recognize it. Gah! Still so frustrating. Hey, don't worry, dude. It's cool. Sometimes I forget fighting moves, but don't sweat it. We can keep hold of it, hold off of it for now, but maybe we'll come across someone who'll jog your memory. Um, wait. Right. Thanks, guys. Really wish you just had the entire crew of them out there for that. I don't know if the devs are listening, because I don't know how many people actually play this game, but um, yeah, it would have been cool if just have the party out instead of swapping. So I don't have that thing as a... I took the kitchen knife off because it was counted as food. Okay. okay, I guess that's it for this area then. Expecting a bit more, but there is something over there. Maybe that's what this is for. Oh my god, it is! Skeetle. Hey there, little burp pal. You like my new digs, Coo? I'm a little out of the way, but the premium retail about is all about location, and I thought the only thing better than exclusive is elusive. Genius, right? I can tell you're discerning customers because you actually found me. Cool. Welcome to Skittle Specials, the most exclusive battle car shop in the world. Only available is true car warriors. I'm only selling one of each item, so everything is priceless. But for you, my pals, I'll do a heavy discount. Okay. So this is where you can buy special moves, I'm guessing? Got your eyes on Lint here, battle car? The card is totally unique, one of a kind. No collection complete without a coup. You know you gotta have it. You won't regret it, Koo, because there's no car in, in the world like this. I should know, because that drew. Come find me next time you're itching to expand. So is it all the partners? This is this Yagi? Dub? Oh. I can't afford it. <laughs> I'm a card scrub. Yagi, hero battle card. And here I had you down as a card warrior. Must be mistaken. More like a card scrub. Well, come back when you caught a clue, and I'll be happy to help you if I'm not sold out by then. Okay, so what is said battle card, right? So maybe that replaces Axel? Maybe it's specials? No. Oh, Lint, there. Oh, look at that. Lint Longtail, a plight, nervous, young raccoon with a talent for writing and a knack for getting lost. You'll find... You helped him find his way in the tangled roots of Forest of Roots after he was separated from his forgetful family. He's a great digger and can whack enemies with his tail. <laughs> I like how he's holding like the pieces of paper in the air. That's cool. 
Um, how much money do I have? 105. Okay, well, I better start whacking stuff now. This will take me back, I assume. Well, I can't afford the Yagi card because um, 600 is the max I can have. Also, did you see my WP? <laughs> my WP in the corner? Like, that's kind of weird. It shouldn't be there. Okay, I guess uh, let me save and then we can go to Mount Lamasari. We can take that balloon thing up there. Oh, they're gone. Wants to progress the story, I guess. Oh, you know what? I'm supposed to be hitting those uh, stone lanterns, aren't I? It'd be nice to know how many I need to do. Let me do that first before we go up. I'll probably need to cut some stuff here. That's fine. Does it update what I need to do? I hear another salamander. I don't see one, though. Maybe he's up above. Ah, oh, there he is. He's behind this rock. These things are very sneaky. Let me just make sure that was the one I heard. It was, okay. There's one of those things. There's two here. Wait, does these not count? Oh, they don't count. Maybe it was the only two in the village. Well, I guess I'll meet you guys back at the village then. Okay, let me see if that was all I needed to do. So I can only find the two here. Just in the nick of time, in one moment longer, we'd all be hot buttered toast on a mountain of regrets. Ew, that was close. Sure, try not to predict any more calamities for a while, okay? No need to fret, young one. All the vibrations have returned to the baseline. But I'll monitor them closely for changes. Here, take this golden sundae. It's a delicious concoction can, that can invert a disaster in a pinch. Has he got any more things to say? You don't seem worried about the um, impending evil, Yagi? Oh, he does this all the time. The stuff he predicts never happens in the end. Oh, wow. He must be very good at preventing them. Okay. Uh, that thing you gave me... Golden Sunday. Holy cow. Um, so I did get the salamanders. So the salamander late. Now we have four, so I can get roundhouse kick. Should I get distortion? Or, because roundhouse kick only does it to one person, but it does six damage to a person. Or I could get blazing vortex. Or maybe distortion? I think because Infernal already does that amount of damage, let's maybe... Go for distortion. That sounds kind of cool. Okay, now we can finally go up here. Last call for Mount Lamasari. Please halt all training inside the aircraft. Remember, there is combustible balloon above your heads, so feeling the burn is greatly discouraged. <laughs> Preparing for takeoff. I've never been in a hot air balloon before, but in the time that I live in, you could see them at a certain time of year. It's pretty cool to see them. My dad will always show me them. Oh, can't break these. Welcome. If you come for the tournament, you're at the right place. Thanks to the help of the great fish, the great pig, and the great monkey, the llamas finally reached the peak of the tallest mountain. They approached the summit where the first monk was, singing his wondrous song. He saw them and welcomed them, showing the llamas to their new home, overjoyed that his song had brought so many. Wishing to reward the great animals who had helped him, he made them the guardians of the summit. For many years, the first monk taught his principles to those who would listen, and at last he retreated tired but content. I don't know why I thought it was like an NPC dialogue. <laughs> Where is there going to be more after that? Oops. Gotta get my money back up. What a beautiful day for a tournament. Oh, so they're all like rock name theme. I didn't really notice that before because I saw the gravel one earlier. Very pleasant weather indeed. <laughs> I 
Yagi's like, hey little guy, can you like chill on destroying stuff? That's not cool. Oh, I guess I got two suck buzz. Do I need to heal at all? Um guess Yagi could use it. I don't like that there's not like a use instead of throwing away. Pebble. Peace and good fortune be with you. Ooh, what's this? A beautiful sand mandala made by the Lamissary monks. As per tradition, it will be dismantled once finished. Be very careful not to sneeze near it. Looks very cool. Oh, <laughs> the camera wanted me to focus on the stairs there, but I'm not going to. Not just yet. Ooh, treasure chest. I see additional 3 RP. Okay. I think I'm fine on the amount of RP I got, so it's not really necessary. Rubble. If you come for the tournament, you're at the right place. Peace and good fortune will be with you. Oh, this one doesn't have dialogue or text for it. Oh, the old Kujitsu guy. Or the bird leader. Oh, these guys. Loaf, Lint, it's me. Uh, Pepper, you rescued me and Rocky and Badger Mines? Oh, yeah. Hey, what are you doing here? I come to take the tournament and make Kujitsu world famous. Oh, what's a Kujitsu? Oh, it's easy. You just... Well, definitely needs to see that. I know, right? I'm so excited. What's Rocky got to say? He doesn't look too happy. Hmm. It's not. Or maybe they have other dialogue. Let's see. Everyone is counting on me. Even the Lapwing. A Lapwings, that's what their name is. Lapwing Elder came. I gotta give it my all. Why is Rocky not talking? That's kind of weird. What a beautiful day for a tournament. I don't know why I give him that voice. I hope there's blood. Oh my god. Very blessed weather did. Yeah, like I'm not gonna. Okay, <laughs> he's just gonna bypass the whole wanting blood part. So we can buy some food here. I don't think I have to. Oh no, I do have the discount. Oh, that's cool. Got glasses on, Gabbro. It's fun to guess who the winner might be, but there are many factors to consider stats, play styles, and even sheer luck. I keep detailed notes on everyone who participates, winners, losers, outside bets, but all is truly in the game of life. Uh, so can we buy stuff, or... Oh my, I'm running the stall, aren't I? I'm terribly sorry, I completely forgot. Welcome, please, browse at your leisure. After all, time is an illusion, and haste is waste. It's not gonna tell me what it does. Have these worldly goods drawn your attention? Perhaps a word? Perhaps a momo? My notes say this is a steamed dumpling with all the kinds of mouth-watering fillings impossible to resist. So as 15 HP and 5 WP, the Lamasary believes in the power of giving freely, but in this case, we prefer donation. Is that agreeable? Uh, I need to use some stuff. Have the... Okay, Sunday. Okay, I already have a Sunday. I'm good. The dumpling thing is pretty good, though. I have all of these already. What's up, Elder? Uh, it's been too long since I intended a tournament coup. You've been, but you, you've been before, Elder. Oh, I did the wrong voice. <laughs> it's kind of hard trying to keep all these voices intact. Been here? Why? Well, I practically used to run the place. You're looking at a five-time Radiant Crown winner, Sonny. Whoa, you were a warrior. You're speaking to a Kujitsu Grandmaster. The ground shook when I walked by. My opponent's spirits, spirits broke like twigs when they saw me. Uh. Standing here brings it all back. The smell, sweat, the pounding of bare feet on stone, it gets the blood pumping. I feel like I could go three rounds with the chalk huff on. Come out on top. Koo, if you have the time, why don't you spot with me and I'll show you youngsters how it's done. Uh, let's go, old man. Hmm, what do you say? Care to try a youthful look against a lifetime battle experience? <laughs> Come at me, old timer. Oh my god. 
Because I got much health. Let's go for distortion. Go for... Let's go for the meteorite knife. Because I just think it's cool. That doesn't really do much damage. Sweet to normal moves, though? That's kind of funny. Uh, slowing him down was actually pretty good, because he only threw two things that time. I want to do that again, just to see if it actually... He does throw less things. He does throw less things. Oh, that's... That's interesting. Unless he was doing different moves, but I doubt it. Oh yeah, we can see Loaf now. Or Lint. But do we get any benefit of having um, Lint as a card, or is it just a cool collectible thing? I don't know. Let's go for the ladle. Finish it off. Not too tough, old man. You fought well. Cool. I suppose time always comes for to pass the torch. Here, take this rare relapwing delicacy. If you're flagging in battle, one day will destroy your fighting prowess. What is it? The golden one? Golden jelly? I got these golden items. I wish you could store these items because I don't want to use them right now. Use a shroom. Actually, toss a cinnamon roll. I want to use the shroom jelly. I wonder if you can fight him to always get the, uh... Uh-oh, can't interact with him. Oh, there we go. It does this old hard good to see young folks whacking each other. Cool. Mess him up, Sonny. I know who this guy is. He's one of the embers. Oh my, what a day. I'm in charge of organizing so much, and you never know what will happen. Last year, a whole stall blew clean off the mountainside, just whipped up and flew 60 feet. That's why I took stall duty this year. I am leaning against whenever the wind picks up, see? We have a wide range of donated goods for sale, so please take a good look and let me know if you can help at all. Please, all proceeds go to Lamasari. Where did, uh, this guy go? Why is he walking around? Piper, is that you? Uh, no? Uh, I'm a sni stripe swiper. You got me. Look, I'm not supposed to talk to you guys. Huh? Why not? It's probably number one. Number one told me I'm on probation. If any other heroes see me helping you, I might lose my hero license. That's why I'm doing this tournament. I gotta climb the leaderboard. Okay. You need to prove you're a hero too, huh? I know it doesn't seem fair, but the last time I saw some... Last time someone criticized number one. We never saw him again. <laughs> Uh-oh. See why he's uh, a little bit frazzled. Just take care, kids. Axel. Hey now. You're the little bystander kids from the Savers Guild. Yeah, we also whooped you guys earlier, too. What a small frazz like you doing at a big event like this. You can get hurt, you know. Where's the wind? <laughs> Ow. I haven't loved like that hard in ages. You really got me with that one, kid. You kids are real cute. You remind me of myself, you know. Back when I was tiny and weak with little new arms. Keep it up, kids. Maybe someday you'll be just like your hero pal, asshole, hmm? Crowd pleaser? Don't I already have crowd pleaser? I think I have this one, too. Oh, wait, I'm out of money? Oh, no. Oh, yeah, I guess it's not surprising to have multiple of the same boon. I already have Cry Pleaser. Maybe, um... So I have that 
W1, which is Perseverance. I don't really use that one. Maybe I can just have two crowd pleasers. Oh, I think we met this guy before. Aren't these trees beautiful? I'm surprised they like it so much all the way here up in the mountains. I wonder if they grow so tall because they can hear the beautiful singing coming from Mount Lomser. I like to be a tall tree on a mountaintop, dancing in the breeze as people sing to me. Slate. <laughs> this is thrilling. The ground shakes with the call of battle. Can you feel it? You are ready to roll the initiative, punk! No, no. I must stay calm. I've chosen to face the sun, and there's only darkness on the path of violence. Think tranquil thoughts. Think tranquil thoughts. Be at peace. Are you at peace yet? I don't like the weird thing the camera does there when uh, you finish somebody's dialogue tree. Oh, I can't talk to them. Don't stand too close. There's photographers in the audience. You're blocking light in my light. I don't want people to see some loser next to me when my picture makes the paper tomorrow. Can you not talk to me? Your negative energy is cluttering up my visualization. Ugh. Could you not talk to me? Your ener negative energy is cluttering up my visualization of the winner's podium. So you kids want an autograph or what? Too slow. These hand- Oh, this is Jean. So you kids want an autograph or what? Too slow. These hands need to rest before the contest starts. Did I read this guy's? Yeah, I did. This guy. Klein. Huh? Hey, Weevils, you already here? Who are you? Oh, uh, me. I'm no one. Just can't believe they let such doofuses in. I thought this was supposed to be a pearl event. Little insects are really gonna enter? Who are you calling an insect? We're not only entering, we're gonna beat you. Haha, <laughs> prepare to be crushed, hey? Scoot on, hey? Claudio. I saw on TV that this is a hot news show in town. I'm not impressed. Not that this place is a big deal, but it's tiny. What do you mean? This, this year the tournament is bigger than ever. Where's the midway, the runway, the fairway? Where are the lights, camera, to go with the action? Well, there might be a journalist somewhere and I heard there's even a podcaster around. Let's hope there's some decent grub at least. I keep hearing this weird noise like it's, you know, like when things are way too quiet, you can usually hear the roar of traffic, the buzz of neons, maybe some distant screams. Uh, no? Well, it's the opposite of that. You listen as hard as you can, and you can't hear any of those things. You mean silence? Silence, huh? That's the stuff the library is always asking for. What does a guy have to do around here to get some deep, something deep fried around here? Now, what the heck is this? A Momo? Let's get rid of that. Welcome, young warriors. You're just in time. The Jade Sage is preparing the opening ceremony. When you're ready to begin, please enter the competitor's arena. I see an apple liver. I'm not going to pick it up. How's these two? Oh, the view up here is stunning. Perhaps there's something to this hiking walk after all. I'm just so glad there was a balloon ride for us this one. My feet are still aching from our last walk. Oh, I recognize some of these warriors from your battle cards. Isn't that Axel over there? Oh, well spotted. Do you think he'd sign this card or to have a pen here somewhere? I wonder if I can get some battle tips from the contestants to improve my game. Not if I can get them first. Okay, I think that's everything. Let's get started. Ah, our latest competitors. Please take a seat and then I'll, we will begin. Welcome all, seasoned warriors, young hopefuls to our humble lamasary. As the most venerable Jade Sage, I will be watching over you all as you compete in the legendary lamasary Annual Martial Arts. 
Is this supposed to be Llama? <laughs> That's funny. In order to find the winner who embodies our values, we wish not only to test fighting prowess, but the strength of character. Therefore, inside the Lamasari, you will face three challenges. One overseen by one of the three guardians of the first monk. What is that, the monkey? Guardian Sunny will challenge your agility. Guardian Zuzu will appraise your wit. Guardian Shell will test your powers of observation. Those who succeed will return here to face off in a no holds barred anything goes combat. Ahem, <laughs> apologies. The victor will be restored the raiding crown and become the Llama champion until next year. If you wish to compete, begin by entering the Llamasari. Good luck to you all. We got this. We got this, guys. Let's go. I know that, uh, I just realized that, uh, Yagi isn't, like, Spanish, but I give him a Spanish accent. Eh. I'm just gonna keep it, because I think he's better with the Spanish accent. Have you noticed the statues that line the long pilgrimage to our Lama commissary? They're actually not statues at all. They ascended our brother. There are ascended brethren, watching over our travelers as they make their way to us. Well, these guys are stone people, so that kind of makes sense. We slimes are born in dark. So are they rock slimes or something? Damn places, but as monks, we pledge to peacefully walk each day in the light. Slowly, we grow taller in these as we reach ever upwards towards the sun. The tallest among us are also the wisest, as they have- Oh, so I, that explains why the guy in the middle is so tall. As they have pondered the five virtues of light and benevolent wisdom for a lifetime. Does this guy have extra dialogue too? Each day we sit and meditate on the path of harmony. As we become tranquil, the poison leaves our bodies and our bodies begin to calcify. Huh. Sometimes a slime who has achieved enlightenment may set fast in position and never move again. May we achieve the perfect stillness of a stone worn by the gentle sunlight. I can't talk to this guy? Oh no, I can. Did you not hear me? Did you not hear me, young hopefuls? The contest has begun. Be thankful we do not dock points for tardiness. You must first complete the three trials that await you within the Lamasari. Okay, I was wondering if he's gonna have other stuff, but that's it. Uh, I think I'm gonna cut it here, just because I've been recording for almost three hours, so I'm just gonna stop here, that way I don't mess up any of the files, so be back in a bit.